about the Pythagorean theorem. I hope you already know about the different triangles, like the acute triangles, the obtuse triangles, the right triangles, the equilateral triangles, the isosceles triangles, and the scaling triangles. But I am not going to talk about triangles today. I am going to talk about the Pythagorean theorem. Now, what is the Pythagorean theorem? The Pythagorean theorem, or the Pythagoras theorem, Pythagoras is this man who found a formula into finding if a triangle had a right angle or not. So, take this as an example. You must learn this. The bottom part of a triangle is called the base. The height, this is the height, or it can be called the altitude. I'll leave it as height. And this, x, is the hypotenuse. The hypotenuse is opposite of the base and the height. And you can tell because this, the hypotenuse, is opposite from this 90 degree angle. This 4 is opposite from this angle. And this 1 is opposite from here. The formula into finding what is x or the hypotenuse is c squared is a squared plus b squared. c squared is the hypotenuse, so leave c is x squared. Now, a squared is 4, so it will be 4 squared plus 1 squared is, 1 is the height, so you leave it as 1 squared. To simplify this, 4 squared is 16 plus 1 squared is 1. x squared is 17. At, you only want to find x, so x would equal square root of 17. And this is their final answer. Now, try another example. You know the base, you know the hypotenuse, you just don't know the height. Same formula, c squared is a squared plus b squared. c squared is four squared is equal to a squared is 5, so it's 5 squared, plus b squared is x, so it's x squared. Now you only want to find the altitude or the height. So take x squared, 5 squared is 25, and 4 squared is 16. Subtract 16 from 25. So 25 minus 16 is equal to 9. x is 3. So the, the altitude is 3. Now, let's try one more example. You know, you don't know the base, you know the height, and you know the hypotenuse. So you need to do the same formula. C squared is A squared plus B squared. So, 3 is the hypotenuse, so it would be 3 squared is equal to x is the base, so it's x squared. 9 is the height, so it is 9 squared. You only want to find the base, so... Now, this might confuse you because they will give you a triangle. You will know the height, you will know the base, and you will know the hypotenuse, but they will not give you the angle. So what do you do? Same, it's a simple thing. C squared is A squared plus B squared. This helps you find out if this part is right triangle or not. So, I want to use this 4 squared is equal to 3 squared plus 3 squared. 4 squared is 16, 3 squared is 9, so this must be 9 too. It's equal to 18. Well, guess what? There's two different answers. So this is not a right triangle. But thank you.
Thanks for watching. If you find this helpful, please comment below.